you mentioned uh, the Falls Road earlier yeah, on. Yeah, like sure. Historic collections yesterday yeah. in the north. What, I mean, what is your take on them? Well, it, I think my granny must be absolutely cheering in her grave at this point because her whole thing went towards the end of her life. She said, I think I'll never see Ireland at peace in my lifetime. And I thought that was an incredibly sad thing yeah. for her to say. I mean, look, uh, the people who were in charge had a good go of it. Look what happened. They made a big mess of it. So it's now time for the new generation. Let's move forward. And, you know, let's be, let's really be the island of Ireland. You know, let's do it. And do you think that, as, as our Gina London was saying earlier on, like, it's the issues that are important. It's not the border poll. It's housing, unemployment. It's the same old story when John Hume was brave enough to stand taller than the rest, like Seamus Heaney called him, one stood taller than the rest. It was a civil rights movement. Yeah. It's about yeah. civil rights. It's not about Protestant and Catholic and all that yeah. nonsense. It, that's just a smokescreen. It's about civil rights, and I'm very glad that the world are seeing that now. Yeah, and I suppose yeah. when you look even at the, the growth in the Alliance Party, yeah. even that says it all, really. That's incredible. It? Yeah, I, it's really I mean, is. I love that there's this generation. I call them the untroubled generation. Yeah. You know, yeah. I'm a child of the troubles. These are the children of the untroubles. <laughs> and I'm delighted about that.